Today is moving day. This is your new home. Daddy. How do you feel? Now we're going to turn them out into their new pastures. Once I unload this, we are officially moved in. What is up, you guys? Today is moving day. If you guys are subscribed to my other channel, I have a vlog channel where I've been doing like moving vlogs. Last night, I was moving until like midnight. Today, we are moving the horses. I am super excited. There's a couple things I need to do. I need to buy hay and I need to buy two water troughs because I'm gonna put Crystal and Brandy together in one pasture and then Journey by himself in the other. And there's no like water holders, buckets or anything at the new place. So we're gonna stop and try and get that. I stopped at Dunkin' Donuts and I got a iced pumpkin chai latte with almond milk. I also got a little turkey sausage, egg and cheese on a, what is this again? English muffin. So we are eating our breakfast because today we have a lot, a lot, a lot to do. Not only are we moving the horses, but I do have to finish up the final details in the apartment and turn it in today. I've had to get out in like a day. Oh, I didn't even mention, I have Sabrina's horse trailer. She's letting me borrow her horse trailer because I thought we would be moving in the rain. I needed an enclosed trailer just so like all my furniture and mattress doesn't get wet. And I still have it, so I'm gonna use her horse trailer to move the horses since it's a three horse trailer. That way I don't have to make two trips, but I might have to still make two trips because if you guys don't know, Journey's still a stallion. I haven't gelded him and I don't know how he's gonna react in a horse trailer with two girls. Let's cross our fingers and hope that his hormones have not kicked in yet. So I was driving and we came across this little farm store. I don't know if you guys can see. And I see a bunch of water troughs outside. There's some laying over there and there's more on that side behind all these cars. So I thought I'd stop really quick and just check the price because your girl is always comparing prices. I got horses, we need to save. <laughs> I pulled into this parking lot and now I'm stuck because there's a huge semi in here and there's no way for me to come out. But I'm just gonna get out, look at the water troughs and then maybe I can just back out of here. I'm in Sabrina's trailer, which is a lot longer. So, you know, things are a little bit more complicated, but we're getting it, we're getting it. It's all about patience. We don't have to rush, people can wait, okay? I think once this lady backs out, I can fit next to that semi. Let's see. This is gonna be a close, oh no, I got it, I got it. Might as well stop right here. We good. Oh, right here. are the prices on there? Okay, I'm gonna go inside and check the prices of these water troughs. I don't see the price on them, but I think these are too big. Um, no, I feel like they're too big in. and they're kind of, pro oh, is that something coming lie. in here? Okay, we're not gonna get a water trough here. Next feed store. By the way, I survived that tiny parking lot with this big horse trailer. We got out in one piece. Truck and trailer are doing well. Crystal is known to like paw at her water trough, so I don't want it too big because I know she'll be tempted to paw and splash. It's just gonna be a mess. So I think a smaller one would be better. All right, you guys, we're at the second feed store. I'm actually gonna buy some hay here as well, but hopefully they have a water trough. We'll see. 40 gallon, I need two of these, but it seems like they only have one. Okay, you guys, so it was a little bit pricier than the other feed store and they only had one So I think I'm just gonna go to one more feed store on my way home once I have the horses and everything I think that one's gonna be a better bet just because they have a lot more stock and I think they are a little bit on the more Affordable side. Anyway, we're picking up the hay right now. We're waiting for them to load it. It started pouring rain So the hay is gonna get wet, but it's fine. I'm gonna try and just feed it right away But yeah, it's a rainy day. That's why I borrowed Sabrina's trailer for the move I knew that this would happen But luckily today it's just the horses in the back and then I think I do have a few more things but I'm gonna use her tack room slash dressing room area to put any like household items I still need to move over. It was such a sunny day like 10 minutes ago. Hi girls, I got your hay. There's one for you. All right, you guys, so we are officially done emptying out. Oh, it's really dark in here. I'm officially done emptying out the apartment. This is what we've been doing since we got here. Give you guys a quick little overview, cleaning, emptying out all the final details, blah, blah, blah. I'll show you guys on this side, empty. And now it's time to go get the horses. I'm a little bit nervous because I'm doing Journey with Crystal and Brandy, and I hope his little stallion hormones haven't developed much yet, because if not, I might have to take the two girls and come get Journey separately. We're gonna hope that everything turns out okay. Anyway, let's go. I got my keys. We'll We'll load Journey first, that way he's not behind the girls and their womanly scents don't trigger him. And hopefully he loads because Sabrina's trailer is a little bit different. I'll show you. It's a step up and her step up is super high compared to my little red rusty trailer. Journey's used to my red trailer, but the step up on this one is really high. Right now it doesn't look as high because I'm totally tilted on hill, but hopefully he does okay with it. Hi Journey boy. Hi. Are you ready to go to your new home? Mm -hmm. So excited for you to see it. You're gonna love it, my boo boosh. Okay, I hope you're good, and I hope you load good. Don't be crazy now.
issue. I don't want to record the whole thing because I don't want my camera to die. I feel like we're going to be here a while, Journey. Why? Why do you do these things, huh? He does so well sometimes and then other times he's just all over the place. It's a new trailer, so it's okay. Eventually. All right, you guys, we got him in. I couldn't vlog it, but basically... <laughs> George and I, my brother switched roles, so I gave Georgie the lead rope, and then I just went behind Journey and kind of, and he went right in. He just needed me behind him, not in front. We're opening all the windows, because last night when we were moving all the furniture, I sealed the whole backside because it was raining. So now we're going to open it up so Journey Boy gets some air. <laughs> Now we're getting Brandy girl here. I think I'm gonna put Brandy right behind Journey just because she's shorter and Crystal's so long So she usually needs the end of the horse trailer on journey's side and he doesn't have a clip on this and i've always been scared of these things like popping off while i'm driving so i'm just gonna try and tie a string there just to be safe all right you guys we are on our way and journey's doing a lot better once the truck gets moving he does calm down a bit of course there's moments where he's still pounding like a crazy but so far so good now i am nervous because i do have to stop at the feed store if you guys remember this morning i was trying to find a water trough i still have to find that and my plan was to stop at the feed store but i didn't realize how naughty journey would be so i'm kind of scared to leave them in the parking lot for too long but i need i need to do it i need somewhere to put water for them so i'm gonna go and, and just rush try my best to do it as fast as possible and hopefully journey's still in one piece when we come back out but yeah getting him into the trailer today was a little bit crazy i'm sorry i didn't vlog it honestly it's just because i knew he would be a little bit crazy and i kind of need both hands but all we did is just switched i put george in the front holding his lead rope and then i went behind him and i had like a little piece of hay string and i just kind of flung it behind him like this and I was like, and then he went right in. Literally the first try. I don't know how I'm gonna do it when I'm alone, but now that he's getting older, we're obviously gonna do more training, which I'm excited about. But yeah, he needs a lot more time in the trailer to get used to it. A few moments later. Oh, it's green, ah! Yeah, he's good. He's good? We just did a little check on a red light to make sure his foot didn't go through the floor of the trailer. I have that irrational fear every time I trailer horses is I feel like their foot's gonna like break through the floor. I don't know why I always think that. It's just this dumb thing that's always on my mind. So my brother just went out and checked on him and he's fine. Okay, we're here and we're trying to rush. Yep, you guys. I just found this one and it's cheaper than all the other places I saw them at. Grab it. I need two of them. I'm gonna check on Journey. Journey, are you good? Everyone alive? Everyone in one piece? One, two, three. Okay, let's go, let's go. I don't know if you guys can see Brandy's little nose. She's like sticking her little nose out of it. Eventually. All right, you guys, we are here. Is everyone good? Brandy's been sticking her nose out the whole time. It's kind of cute. But anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and just close the gates to the pastures. They have like different openings. So imagine I like turn the horse out and then they come out from somewhere else. So let's do that first. Now for this pasture, we put the water trough in here already. And then I'm just gonna close this one because this is like a little paddock on this side too. And then they have this pasture. On this side we close the little doors, we close that gate, and then the water trough is here. Now let's go ahead and get these horses out because Journey's having his little fit. Hi mama, this is your new home. Are you ready? You're so cute. Camera's gonna die, but there you go. They're exploring, look how cute she is. Okay, my camera died, so I'm filming on my phone. Quality might not be as good, but the girls are out there exploring, doing their thing, nice and calm. Now I'm gonna get this, this crazy one.
hose out of here. Knowing him, he'll probably get tangled. All righty. Let's fill their water bucket for the first time. Oh my goodness. So satisfying. I don't know why this is satisfying to me. All right, you guys, the horses are officially in their new pastures. This is like their setup for now. Once Journey gets gelded, I'll probably switch them around. But yeah, they're officially home. All right, you guys, I actually brought all my tack stuff. So I have my huge tack box in here, my feeding bin, my little cart that I use for hay, and my big red horse trailer. I just backed it up into the barn and we're gonna try to unload it. But yeah, this is the last bit of it. We are done. Once I unload this, we are officially moved in. unloaded the big box this little box too my little cart feed bin we are done now i gotta go park this trailer okay you guys today i'm bringing the chickens over to the new place hi guys hi are you guys ready to go to your new home but it's a short drive. Now it's Dougie's turn. I'm actually gonna take him on my lap. I got a little plastic bag so he doesn't poop on me. But let's grab him. driving we're going a short distance so we're safe hopefully he doesn't freak out if not i'll just put him on the floor of my car Dubby, how do you feel you like the ac <laughs> the chickens are back there my car is a mess a few moments later so i ended up putting him down there just because he was freaking out and i think it's just better for him to be loose he's gonna poop but i have a plastic floor protector or a rubber floor protector so it's fine yeah daddy what happened Dougie? all right you guys i'm here and i just put Dougie in the stall i'm gonna go ahead and get the chickens Hi guys, how was the ride? This is Dougie's first time out of the stall. Last night was pretty good, nothing crazy happened, luckily. <laughs> He's messing with Nike. Do you like it out here? The chickens are slowly making their way out. They're still a little unsure. There they go. Hi Coco, come Nike, come over here. I hope you guys enjoyed coming along on the whole moving process. It was a little bit crazy. Now I'm gonna spend the rest of the day just unloading all of my stuff into the house. If you guys wanna see those kinds of videos, definitely check out my other YouTube channel. I'll leave it linked down below. But yeah, the horses are doing pretty good. I hope you enjoyed watching. Please give this video a thumbs up if you did. Also subscribe if you haven't already. Here is my notification shout out. If you guys wanna be shouted out in my next video, all you have to do is turn on your post notification bell and then leave me a comment letting me know that you've done it. And that is it. See you in my next video. Bye.